All right, uh, finally some good news. The third apartment that we saw on day two uh, is still available. So I'm going to the bank to get all the documents that they need. We had looked at three apartments. I can't remember was it day two or day three. But uh, yeah, the third one is available. So which is good. I do like the apartment. So uh, I am so excited. Right, so I'll go to the bank, get all the papers and then head to the real estate agent. And as usual, Uber. I need to go to Square One Mall. That's where my bank is. And I really hope uh, it's not a long wait time. I need to be there at 11.30. It's 10 in the morning right now. So, let's hope for the best. Right, we're heading to the bank right now. I'm at, I'm, I'm in the car. So, what's your name, sir? Jamal. Jamal. Um, oh, you know my name, sir. Yes. We got a permanent residency in 2017. 2017. Then we went back. Because we needed to save some money. Yes. <laughs> and how long have you been here? Uh, around four years. Okay. And where, where did you come from? I am from Iraq. Iraq? Oh, okay. Which part of Iraq? I, I was also before in Dubai. Which part of Iraq are you from? I'm from Baghdad. You were in Dubai? I was in Dubai, yes. For how many years? Uh, for 17 years. Wow. Yes. Wow. That's a long time. Long time. I was there for 12 years and I yes. thought that was too much. No, no. <laughs> From uh, 1997, right? In 300 and I left Dubai. I came here uh, 2013, make landing. After that, return back to Dubai, like like me, yeah. And return back at the end of 2014. You came back at the end of 2014. Okay, right. I've reached the bank. I hope this is a really quick process and doesn't take a lot of time. So let's go for that. Bank TD Canada Trust. Right, it's so sunny. It's minus six, but it's fine. Doesn't feel like too cold, so. Right, so I just got done with the bank. I've got the bank check or the money order thing that they want. Usually what they need is they need a first and a last month's rent in form in a form of a money order. So I've got that. But the bank stuff went really smooth. Um, it was very quick. I spoke to a guy called Matthew. And it was really helpful. Uh, happened in, in half an hour. So I'm really, really impressed with TD Bank. So I've just booked an Uber. And I'm going to go back to my hotel. Then we're going to rush to the rental agent. And I really hope to get this. And she said she's going to put the application and get this approved on the same day, which is great. Uh, let's see how that goes. So right now I'm waiting for my Uber to go back to my hotel. They look like M&M. But they're Skittles. Yeah, they look. They look like M&M, but they're Skittles. Why do they look like M&M? I don't know. Because they're not M&M, but they're Skittles. Right, so we are at the building at the moment. We're just waiting for her to come. She's probably gone for another viewing for another tenant. Hopefully not for the apartment we're going to take. So. so we are at 1547 Mississauga Boulevard. That's where the, well, that's not the apartment. The apartment is not at 1547, but this is her office. So, hence we are here. Fingers crossed we get it and no more apartment hunting from tomorrow. Okay, so we finished our uh, paperwork and she sent our information to the rental company, the main office, to get it approved. And once that is approved, we will get our apartment. So, yeah. Looks like finally things are falling into place. Uh, this is really good. I, from now, I don't think I need to... Oh, Uber's booked. I don't think I need to look for any more apartments. I'm still not completely at peace. But, let's see. But good stuff. I'm not going to look at any more properties. And look at... what? Yeah, look at that. This is Mississauga Boulevard. What? Yeah, the bus station right there. Wow. Wow. And yeah, this is a good property. And I'm really happy if this works out. I'm not being really pessimistic. I'm being a little careful. She said she is going to uh, give us a call on Tuesday or Monday to let us know if our application has been approved. And then we need to come back and do signatures for the lease agreement and all that thing. So 
the lease agreement starts from the 1st of April until one year. This is a relief. I know I did not show you guys the apartment. The day I saw this apartment, I saw three. That was the first day. And I showed you the first two and I did not show you the last one. So, maybe I didn't show it to you. We got it. Ooh. Once we move in, I will show you the apartment. And no, wait. Before we move in, because we asked her that uh, if we can get a viewing again. Because uh, I don't seem to remember the apartment. Strange reason. Sidra does. I don't seem to remember it. I remember it very vaguely. She's given us a floor plan. It is 930 square feet. 932 to be precise. And uh, let me check on the Uber driver one second. Oh, it's three minutes away. Yeah, it is 932 square feet. It's costing us $1840 per month. Excluding parking and excluding hydro. Hydro, they say, is going to be about 50 to 60 dollars and parking is 80 dollars so when i get a car i'm gonna apply for parking but the base rent is 18 40 dollars that includes water and heating which is good well i don't know i mean we've seen so many properties and this seems fairly it's overpriced i mean look don't get me wrong it's overpriced for what it is the demand is so huge because any immigrant or anyone who comes into Canada well not any but from India or Pakistan or uh, you know the Asian countries wants to stay in Mississauga the simple reason is you have a big community here and uh, you feel more at home and especially for that reason the prices have gone up really really high and if you ask me this apartment is definitely not worth 1840 but you know how it is. Real estate is really expensive in Toronto. Ah, I'm just happy we have an application in the process. Right, we finished most of our work. And right now we're going to Tim Hortons. To have coffee. Well, I can't have cold coffee now. I've got a bad throat. So I'll take probably the cappuccino or something. All right there, that's Tim Hortons. Look. Yeah. I think I'm finally done apartment hunting right so as you know we have submitted our application and we will only hear back on Monday I'm guessing it's gonna be positive I've spoken to the real estate agent again I'm uh, not sorry not the agent I've spoken to the building management lady who takes care of the contract and she seems to be positive that I'll get it so I'm not gonna hunt for any more apartments which is great uh, I have to move out of this hotel uh, tomorrow morning so I have to go and pack right now really quick. Well, the only silver lining is the moving to a floor above us. So it's like one floor above us and not to an entirely different building. I have to check out by 11. So it's not too bad. I usually get up way too early uh, anyways. Yeah, so get up, move apartments and uh, I have no plans for tomorrow. Not really. Tomorrow the weekend, tomorrow the Saturday. So anyways, that was today. Hope you guys liked it. Until next time, be safe and be healthy. Bye.